Hey Pisces, I hope that everybody is doing well. Before we get into this, I would like to set the intention for this to be a space where everyone allows themselves to feel seen and validated and ultimately for this to be a safe space and a healing space in alignment with everyone's highest good. Okay, I'm just going to shuffle quickly and then we'll get into it. We may have recently ended something, a dynamic with somebody. Looking at Gemini. An ending. Yeah, we're being guided to walk away. If we have not already, I'm getting, okay? Because something is finished. I'm hearing completely. Okay. There was a cycle that's completed with whoever this person is. I'm looking at judgment being called Pisces. Now we're walking towards. I'm hearing the envelope. Something about using our throat chakra. Okay. I'm hearing development. There was a union, a harmony, a dynamic, something that is completely finished now, okay? We had victory with this thing. Whatever we were being guided to do, I'm seeing that this has completed. Maybe something that we had a hard time facing, but I'm seeing that we did, Pisces. And we're walking away from any offers to re-engage with whatever this is, okay? This can be a Capricorn. I'm hearing doesn't have to be, can be. And I'm seeing that... Um, we're meditating and also manifesting by using our throat chakra. It's going to help us in this next step that we're moving into, I'm seeing, because we're being guided to go into a new direction. There's going to be a change that's happening. I'm hearing change circulating, okay? We may be observing whatever this thing is, but I'm getting that there's information coming in and also that we're gathering regarding this. There's a transition that we're moving into, okay? And I'm seeing us stepping into a more masculine energy. Maybe with the way that we even go about addressing people, I'm seeing something going on with communication, okay? I'm hearing float like a butterfly with the king of swords. Mastering the way that we use the throat chakra. And I'm seeing us moving away from some sort of chaos. getting a change with how we pick up information as well okay maybe the way that we're processing something and i'm seeing us develop developing in regard to i'm hearing our emotional habits i'm looking at a lot of masculine energy here okay and i'm getting moving up levels with whatever this is pisces there may be um Somebody, um, somebody that's very much in a grounded space coming in to communicate something with us. I'm hearing somebody who knows what's what, okay? 
we may have been really worrying um, about something, maybe a dynamic that we had with someone, but I'm seeing that we're being guided to move away, okay? There's a change that happens when we're embracing our emotions. The stability that they can provide for us as we mature in that place. And I'm seeing that us looking around us and gathering information. I'm hearing with an unbiased lens. Provides us um, clarity and I'm seeing us calling something out. And then us moving away from losing sleep. Moving into some sort of dynamic, okay? That we're being guided into. Maybe with somebody in touch with their emotions. Because I'm getting that we may have been disappointed by someone. Someone we felt attracted to. But I'm seeing us getting into a place where we feel good creatively. And really working on that. Working on gaining the foundation that we need also to start a new project. I'm getting. Something new creatively. Something we're going to have new feelings for. I keep hearing new wave. Hearing justice, honor, and balance. Looking at Libra. Stepping into a place where we're balancing this out. Maybe someone stepping towards us in that energy. I'm hearing the word overwhelming. This is somebody from our past. This can be a Libra from the past. This can also be a fire sign. I'm seeing that we're stepping into our power. I'm hearing stepping into our energy by balancing things out in a just way, communicating. I'm hearing leveling the field getting things done and there's a transformation with the energies approaching us i'm getting how we allow people to come in and approach us this is also communicating with someone if we don't appreciate the way that they're approaching us as well being vocal about that not shying away with people from the past. I'm hearing not accepting that. Especially when our intuition is telling us about the way that somebody's coming in to approach us to Pisces. There may also be a transformation. Pisces, somebody may have approached us before in the Knight of Wands energy where they, um, it wasn't mature, it wasn't romantic in the way that we wanted it to be Pisces, and I'm seeing that there's a transformation going on with something, maybe somebody, an individual from the past. Somebody that we know about, okay? Being guided to release the things that don't allow us to be at ease. I'm getting balancing something out with our um, responsibilities. Moving away from a place where we had been stressing out about the dynamics that are stepping towards us. Healing from this energy. I'm hearing the word bipartisan. Interesting. Okay, I'm looking at the magician.
being guided to end something to manifest the ending I'm getting acceptance as well okay part of the guided path And switching it up from being in our heads to stepping into our energy, our passions. And this is justice for whatever dynamic that we had with someone in the past that needed to be ended because it was not healthy. I'm getting that this definitely just needed to be finished because you want to manifest the happiness that you're capable of manifesting rather than circulating with whatever this energy is that you knew was not going anywhere because I'm getting that something has definitely completed. I'm hearing um, run its course. Yeah, judgment was called. That's why this thing needed to be ended. Maybe you had a perception that things could work out with this person, but I'm seeing that spirit was guiding you not to because it would have just brought confusion. But that's why you're ending this because it helps you find clarity in the confusion that you had been feeling before. Someone may be coming in to communicate with us. They may be back and forth about whether they're going to do this or not, Pisces. I'm seeing that we're being guided to plan and that when we do so, it's going to help us with whatever this thing is that we were juggling. Bringing down clarity as we do the work that we're being guided to do. We're being guided to alchemize something as far as the plan, as far as the movement, and as far as whatever this is that we're juggling. This can be something with finances. This can be something with a move that we want to make in general. It doesn't have to be with finances. This can be with a person as well. And I'm seeing that the messages that come in for us, the offers that come in for us are going to be giving us clarity. This can be messages about our intuition. And I'm seeing that we're getting clarity on the ideas that we want to manifest, the things that we want to work, about our energy, about what we're capable of, Pisces. Stepping into our divine feminine energy. I'm hearing planetary movement. Maybe there's um there are contacts going on um soon that are going to Yeah. We are being guided to really put our heads down and do the work. Very much so. And I'm getting that there's going to be some sort of... I'm getting like breakaway. There's going to be some sort of break that we get in this, okay? As we continue. Because I'm seeing us moving into a better place where we're going to feel um, more gratification as far as our emotions, passions, creative projects. There's a celebration that we're moving into. I'm getting something again about like breaking free of something.
because we're following our intuition and moving into this place. I'm seeing our guides kind of leading us. They're like, come over here. We have something to show you. Yeah, the falling right over the Three of Cups, which can represent our guides. That's how I read it. I'm looking at us getting connected. We may be being guided to take a break. Tune in. I'm getting that our guides are like trying to show us something, okay? Pay attention to the things around you, Pisces. Get in touch with your intuition. This is where you're moving into because you're following the lead. It's like if you're feeling depleted, it's because you need to remove yourself from a situation or plan to get to the end of this thing because I'm seeing that when you do, you're moving into a much better place emotionally, okay? Getting, it's like your guides are like, come over here. You're being put right back on track. Maybe you felt like you strayed a bit. I'm getting again, too, that this could be something planetarily um, going on in your chart. I'm getting shift. I'm getting movement. And I'm seeing that your intuition is telling you to step up when it comes to this role that you want to be moving into. And I'm getting that this is where we go. This is where we're coming to. I'm hearing driving our own ship, Pisces. Stepping into a role of major stability. I'm getting asking for the things that you're wishing for. Releasing fear. I'm here releasing nonsense. You could have something going on with, um, with your um, mental that you need to check. Meaning something that you need to manage, okay? And I'm getting that um, we're being guided to release that. And to hold on to what we find is going to be important. This can be resources as well for this next move. I'm hearing the word career. Yeah, I'm seeing us in our heads about having to release something. But I'm seeing that it's being guided, okay? For our wish fulfillment to come to fruition. Also being guided to communicate something, okay? Okay. There's communication that's going to be coming in, possibly about money, about some new beginning, about something that we've been manifesting. Yeah, there's an offer coming in. There's communication about this that we're going to be receiving. I'm hearing Scorpio. I'm hearing Scorpio heavily. That's what's coming through. Something that's going to offer us assistance with what we're manifesting when we get connected. This is something that we might be channeling as well. There's an offer that's going to come in um, that's going to provide us something regarding building a home illumination something that we're happy about okay something stable something we can trust i'm getting that this is why we're being guided to look within and release the things that need to be released so we can make room i'm hearing make way because there's something that's hidden right now okay a transformation and also maybe the ro the role that we're stepping into I'm hearing the rules of the road, Pisces. I'm looking at Pisces. I'm looking at Scorpio. Virgo, Aquarius, Taurus. I'm hearing Pisces again. Venus, Sagittarius. Pluto, Mercury, Libra. All right, we're going to do one more spread, Pisces. We may have been feeling like the offers that were coming in for us were not ones that we wanted to engage in. 
Like they weren't um, sufficient. I'm getting like a really big sense of apathy. I'm getting like it wasn't cutting it. Okay. Now I'm hearing waiting on the one. Just said waiting on the one. The Ten of Swords keeps popping out. I'm getting like there was a really big cycle, maybe multiple cycles with multiple people that we were being guided to end. Again, to make room. It's like making way for something, something that's going to be coming in. Because of the experience that uh, we had in the past where we may have thought that we found a partner or a happy ending, whatever we were looking for. And we were guided to end it because it was not working for us. I'm getting it was not working with us. And we're getting justice now for this. I'm hearing long time coming, Pisces. It's like the justice for going through all the things that you did and also ending the cycles when you were being guided to because you knew that it needed to be finished. And now you want to plan for your future, for the happiness that you want to step into, that you know is available to you. Being guided to alchemize, like, the decision to end things because you knew that it was the right thing to do for you, Pisces. I'm hearing with these people, and I'm seeing that we receive um, a transformation. We move through a transformation as is justice to the to these situations i'm looking at our guide celebrating the next moves on the path because of what we plan for i'm seeing something going on with our creativity something where we're feeling like i'm getting like getting our mojo back i just saw 2244 getting our mojo back okay and i'm seeing that we're also stepping into a place regarding something with our money okay Something with the home, something with this position we're stepping into, where we feel really stable. Um, I'm getting the scent of sandalwood. Maybe somebody likes that smell. Maybe that's reminiscent of something for you. Now I'm getting incense and candles. I'm hearing patchouli. We're moving into a place of reciprocity and a dynamic, maybe finding somebody that we really connect with. I'm looking at the Six of Pentacles and I'm looking at the Two of Cups that we manifested. I'm getting because we made room for this. This is why the cycles needed to end before. This was why we were guided. looking at Libra, Sag, Scorpio, and Virgo, Pisces. Yeah, there's, there's a connection that we're going to be making with somebody, okay? In a union that feels equal, this is going to be a surprise for us, this thing coming down, okay? I'm looking at a feminine. It's either you in this feminine role or feminine stepping towards you, okay? All of us have masculine and feminine within. Just matters on this particular dynamic, who's receiving and who's taking action. I'm seeing reciprocity union, harmony, marriage with a person, something that we're extremely shocked by, okay? There's like some big surprise, maybe 
I don't know if this is somebody that we're going to be meeting and just the fact that we realize we have a really deep connection with somebody. This is like soul tie, soul connection, somebody that we feel we're very compatible with and like a mind blow about this because I'm getting a huge tower that happens in regard to finding reciprocity with another individual Pisces. And I'm seeing that this is what we manifest because we walked away from people that we did not feel were trustworthy in the past. Even though we may have been attracted to certain individuals, I'm seeing that we were guided to walk away from them. And that's how we're now able to manifest this. I'm hearing um, create this, okay? So we made room for whatever this is. And now I'm looking at Little Hermit, looking within his lantern. I'm hearing the viewfinder, finding this collaboration dynamic that's being called out. I'm getting like your intuition is talking to you. Listen up. I'm hearing viewfinder again. I'm seeing us getting assistance i'm getting by changing the mind frame okay about the things that we were feeling that stress us out Maybe it's taking on a lot also to distract us from the things that were hurting us in the past. It's like finding a bunch of things to do so you don't have to focus on that. Distraction is a good technique until you feel grounded enough to visit things. So there's no shame in that. And I'm seeing spirit guiding you into some sort of dynamic with someone, a collaboration, okay? Spirit also may have been throwing a lot of things at you, so you were distracted. But I'm seeing that your manifestations are providing you with assistance, okay? And I'm seeing something coming. I'm hearing from the cleared heart space. It's like, I'm getting that we may have been receiving a lot of tasks so we didn't self-sabotage something. Maybe um, waiting until we were in a healed space before we entered into dynamics with others, okay? I'm here keeping the mind busy. Until we could be grounded and enter whatever dynamic this is. I'm hearing a lesson in growing. I'm looking at Saturn over here. And I'm seeing that now we receive clarity after going back and forth about something, about what was being juggled. There's an epiphany moment that we receive about the lesson. I'm hearing taken on and I'm hearing completed, okay? Oh, and I didn't even see this. The Ace of Cups was below the world. This now comes after completing this lesson, okay? Maybe a connection with another. And I'm getting like... The strengthening of our powers, okay, of our intuition, of our abilities. Whatever innately we feel like is a grand part of our energy, I'm getting, okay? Whatever we we like about our abilities and harnessing that. Okay, we're going to end it there. Um, just to go over the signs, I'm looking at um, Saturn, I'm looking at Mercury, I'm looking at Taurus, Virgo. Mars, Scorpio, Sagittarius, and Libra.
Okay, we're going to end it there. I would like to thank everybody for joining. Thank you for being here. I'm wishing everybody love and light and healing, and I will catch you guys next time. Bye, Pisces.